after this cup of coffee, it's well, another cup of coffee, but Ironically, then I'm off to work with the colors. The what? You know the Ginyus. There's the red one, the beige one. Yeah! <laughs> 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 You nasty. Talk about I said, your man behind the camera director here with another Home for Infinite Losers, episode eight, Little Lord Frieza. In the last one, we saw King Daddy pull up and start imposing his will on everybody in the cul-de-sac. Uh, it was an interesting dynamic to see that he is, he has become so reformed that he has now been entrusted as a member of management. However, in that last little action interaction he had with Cell, it kind of seems like mm, he might be up to some devious ass shit. I don't know, me personally, I'm looking at uh, King Daddy real funny, bro. I'm looking at him real funny, but he does seem to have a plan. And to be honest with you, to be honest with you, it's one of those things like, it's almost in, if you're truly evil, right? Hear me out, just, just ride with me for a second. If you are truly evil, it would be at your behest to actually get reformed, try reformment so that you can escape hell, so you can keep uh, wreaking havoc. You know what I mean? I know they kind of wrote in there that like you have to truly be reformed. I don't know, man. I feel like if I was truly evil to my core, I would be able to reform myself enough to pass and then go right back to my old self or like reform yourself so much. You stay reformed, but then something slowly but surely wears you down and you go back to your formal self. <laughs> That's just me though. I don't know nothing, but we're gonna jump right into this one. If you made it this far and you haven't already, go watch theirs again. Comment in there, uh, yo, DN's watching this, go check him out. And then come back over here, watch mine two times, two times, comment down below. Who's your favorite character thus far? To be honest with you, Raditz might be at the bottom of that list, but I think he's near the top of mind. Raditz is a very, very interesting dynamic character, not to take your eye off of him. And then closely followed by Zarbon, but not too closely, cause you know why. Uh, reaction starts now. Little Lord Frieza. King Daddy. Whose house is this? Hello? Oh. Oh, good morning, Frieza. Are you here to borrow a movie? What? Over script. No. Why would I? We're lending them out to help our MCM socialize. You know, a little water cooler talk. I Damn don't want a him. movie. I'm here to talk to my father. Yeah, yeah. King Daddy? Cold! Your little baby boy is here! Be right down. He'll be right down. He'll be right down. Ah, there you are. Oh, oh. God, Daddy, where's your decency? Oh, come on, Frieza. There's nothing to be ashamed about. Literally, there's nothing there. Oh. I still have so many questions about that. But that's King not Daddy, where is your daddy I'm thing? I'm ready to talk about yesterday. It's so oh. creepy. Well, I'm sorry, it's so Princess. Creepy. I'm terribly busy right now. After this cup of coffee, it's... Well, another cup of coffee, but Ironically, then I'm off to work the with the colors. The what? You know, the Ginyus. There's the red one, the beige one. Yeah! <laughs> 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 Bro, I call us the colors. You can't do that. Damn. One, the normal one. Wait, the normal but one. I am white. Oh and god. Most of the galaxy isn't. Good. Your coffee is getting you. King Daddy, good I job. I better get to that. We'll talk later, princess. But I. Toodles. Why is he naked? Why does he not have a cock? So many oh, questions. You. Actually, that's all. Visiting Daddy. Maybe. What are you <laughs> doing here? Oh, I'm just here to return the ogre's copy of Caddyshack 2. Did you know they only have sequels down here? And just the bad ones. What? Which means they only have Robocop 3. And I Ooh. never saw Robocop 2, but since they skipped it, it must have been better somehow, and uh... <coughs> that is hell. Wonder which diehards they have. For which diehards they have? That's painful. All right, men. Today I've acquisitioned you I for like an exceptionally important task. Mm. These are very special blueprints for a very special arena. Is that Your a custom job King is to Daddy clean helmet? up this rock and build it to these exact specifications. Sir, yes, sir. Uh, permission to speak? Granted. What, what is this for? Ah, uh, that is a secret, my normal little friend. Oh, uh, he's the normal oh, okay. one. Okay. Thanks. Goodbye, Sokola. Ah, uh, it's Cousin Pretty. 
You have 24 hours to complete this task. Can I count there on you? There it is. We'll have it done in half there the it time. Is. Give a tank the other half of the time. Good. Proceed. Sir, yes, sir. Um, Daddy? Oh, Princess, you can't be here. You don't have a hard hat. Neither do they. Well, yes, but they're professionals. Oh. All right, mates. First I was about to say, but they're colored. Land out. Call down. We need a steamroller. I got it. What are those? No. Whoa, no. I know the JoJo sound. I hear it. On Recoom three, Recoom one, Recoom two, Recoom three. Uh, listen, Daddy. Now that you're done delegating, I was for. hoping we could have that talk I mentioned earlier. Uh, you know, I would love to, Freezer, but I'm just buried under all this paperwork. What paperwork? Uh, How? There you go, sire. Very good, Gildo. Makashima. Uh, From it's Gildo. Not, I speak. Uh, never mind. So yeah. we we'll talk later. He's so but racist. I love it. When? Don't worry. I'm sure we'll find the time to find the time. Uh, uh, uh. I wonder what he wants to talk to him about. Oh, and tell Zarbon to get wood for me. Uh, Actually, use the word lumber. Uh, He's smart. Uh, tell Cell I'll be stopping by later for a chat. Yes. Oh, that's the last straw. No, poor Raditz. No, leave Raditz alone. Oh, uh, hey there, Lord Frieza. Just bringing your father uh, another cup of coffee. Guess that's what I'm doing today. <laughs> That new nail. Tell him to come pick the pebbles out of my folds. <laughs> out of my folds. What are they talking about? Are they talking about me? Of course they're talking about me. How dare they? Poor I'm right princess. here. If you have something to say, then say it to my face. But what if they're not talking about me? What if he hasn't talked about me all day? Oh, which is worse? I was just thinking that. And now they're laughing, which means they're either laughing at me or without me. Oh my god! Take with this. No. I'm going to give them a piece of. That's literally overthinking in real time. Like I swear to you. Like I don't. Over okay, I was gonna say I don't overthink often, but <laughs> that would have been a fucking lie. I do that shit all the time just for fun. But that was one of those times. Like I know overthinking when I see one. That's what it looks like. Poor fella. Of my. Did I just say poor fella to Frieza? <laughs> okay, bitch. Of my. Hey, Lord Frieza. I borrowed us a copy of Terminator Genesis. You want to hate watch it with me? Terminator Genesis. Am oh. I uh, interrupting anything? No, I'm just sulking. Oh. Uh. Permission to comfort. Proceed. So, Aww. Lord Frieza. You can just call me Lord. So, Lord, uh, what's got you down in the dumps? Honestly, it's... It's Cell. Oh? Yes. Ever since that insidious insect entered the picture, everything's gotten worse. Between the neglect and insubordination, I feel like I don't even matter anymore. I used to be Queen Bee. No, uh, I'm just Plan B. Uh, Pizza. Now make it better. Lord, nobody Not here'd even is. dream of thinking that but you. Cell does. Well, maybe it's not about Cell. Maybe it's about you. How dare you? All I'm saying <laughs> is there ain't no reason you okay. should be letting that green goon get under your skin. You used to rule galaxies. He died on the same rock he was born on. The Facts. same rock I died on. And there you mm. go, attacking yourself again. Your Lord Frieza. What's he got that you don't? Talking to Daddy Dearest. I'm going to bed. Oh, okay. I'll be here if you need to talk more. Uh, hmm. Wonder what Zarbon's up to. <laughs> what is Zarbon doing? Ah, damn you, you chartreuse charlatan. I swear, when Char I see you next, I'll... Huh? 
Daddy? Are you kidding me? Daddy? Even in the middle of the night? Wait. Daddy? <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> Lord Freezer, the Doria told me you were in a state. Oh, I want no. to tell my god. I, I said lumber. Hmm? Oh. No, that's unrelated. <laughs> Lumber, bring me lumber. Now bring me wood. Never tell Zarmon to bring you wood or unrelated. Hmm. And the weird oh. thing, they don't even have Die Hard 2, but they have With a Vengeance, which I just think is objectively Ooh. wrong. I mean, is it? You know, it didn't even start out as a Die Hard script. Which I think is to its benefit. And would you really call it worse Aww. than two? Well, I like Die Hard with a Vengeance. Well, obviously. So is this really all you wanted to talk about? Yes. <laughs> that was home for infinite losers. Little Princess Frieza. Um, yeah, it's a very interesting dynamic. Uh, King Daddy kind of is just trolling his little princess, refuses to talk to Frieza, and it's really giving Frieza like massive overthinking and insecurity issues. Um, not that I feel bad for Frieza, because let's be honest, he says monkey, he tried to destroy a planet, and he don't fuck with Saiyans. It's fuck Frieza on every front. However, I can see how he's being slowly but surely pushed and gaslit by King Daddy. Um, again, the bars and the lines in this are always hilarious. He goes, tell Zarbon to bring me wood. Actually, tell him lumber. Yo, because you all know, if you tell Zarbon to bring the wood, he's coming with that hard, and you gonna put it in your face. I don't want that. Leave that somewhere else. Bring me the Doria, maybe, because apparently the Doria be out here slaying it. She got the best thing in the galaxy, allegedly. Allegedly. I'm not saying I'd hit the Doria, but I ain't gonna hold you in front of that door when Frieza closed the door in her face and the Doria just standing there like patting her hips. I was like, yo, she kind of bought it back, but she got that wide bottom too. <laughs> maybe. I'm not gonna say would. I'm not gonna say wouldn't. I'm gonna say meh. I don't know. It was good enough for Raditz. Wasn't good enough for the rest of us. Speaking of Raditz, I don't like he keeps getting the shit end of the stick on this, man. Like, like no, no, dead ass. I just knew as soon as Raditz ran into Frieza, it just wasn't going to end well. It was not going to end well. I'm upset that he even stopped to talk to Frieza. He just knew it was going to go bad. But it's one of those things like, is it when some, when you know he don't like you, is it worse if you stop and try to be friendly and hope he takes mercy on you? Or is it worse if you just try to walk by and ignore him and now he's just sneaking you because you ignored him? With people like that, the best course of action is to just steer clear. Me personally, I'd have seen Freeze. I'm like, yeah, nah, 0% chance I'm even going in his general vicinity. I'm going all the way around. As far around as humanly possible that I can get. No doubt in my mind. Like, I'm staying away from him because fuck him, that's why. Um, I feel like this episode uh, is a little bit slower. It was a connecting if episode, I feel like. So, like, they're building up to something, whatever King Daddy is doing in the background that's not involving Cell. At least we don't, I don't think it's involving Cell. Even little Princess Frieza doesn't quite know what's going on. But it seems like he's, you know what, I understand. To be evil, to get caught in an evil scheme, you have to actually be evil scheming. However, if you give a bunch of little people jobs to do and it's leading up to one big scheme, maybe you could get away with it. That's the only thing I could think of. Um, the colored people joke, yo, that shit was OD fucking hilarious. And then Frieza goes, but I'm white. And he goes, but most of the universe isn't. So like what? It's like, ooh, that's spicy. Ooh, put some chili all in my noodles because that shit's hot, boy. But anyways, we're going to end this one here. If you made this far and you haven't already, go ahead, drop a sub. I already told you what to do. Go run it up over there. Comment on their channel. Yo, DN's watching this right now. Go show him some love. Come over here, comment again. Who's your favorite character? What do you think King Daddy's up to? No, 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 no. Don't tell me what King Daddy's up to because some of y'all going to spoil it. Do not tell me what King Daddy is up to. Instead, instead, tell me what the hell Zarbon was doing when he was out there getting lumber. Lumber. What do you think he was doing instead of getting lumber? Me personally, I think the Doria, uh, Raditz, and Zarbon, they, they kind of be they kind of be smashing each other in the background. I noticed not the three of them are never in the same place at the same time. It's weird, but I see it. I see it, son. I remember Honey Cam as always never forget. Hey man, go ahead, stay nasty, y'all. Oh, but I'm really fucking shaking, bro.